Gracious Lord, you inspired Paul to write that every person is subject to the governing authorities because all authorities that exist have been instituted by you. He also says that those in authority are your servants for the good of their people. We thank you, Lord, for your servants here in the Senate of the great state of Alabama and for the good they do for their people. We thank you, Lord, for blessing the state of Alabama and we ask for your continued blessing. Please send your Holy Spirit to abide here today in this Senate that you instituted as they make decisions that affect the people of Alabama. Let your spirit remind the members of the Senate that their authority comes from you and they are accountable to you for their decisions. We pray that your will is sought and done both today and the remainder of each member's term. Lord, I close with a fireman's prayer as I see it, the legislature and firemen are the first line of defense for their people, of course, in different ways. The prayer speaks of flames, Lord, though there may not be physical flames in this chamber, it gets mighty hot at times. The fireman's prayer. When I am called to duty, God, wherever flames may rage, give me strength to save some life, whatever be its age. Help me embrace a little child before it be too late, or save an older person from the horror of that fate. Enable me to be alert and hear the weakest shout, and quickly and effectively to put the fire out. I want to fill my calling and give the best of me to guard my every neighbor and protect his property. And if according to your will I have to lose my life, please bless with your protecting hand my children and my wife. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Coming to lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance is um, Mary Lee.